I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. How are you? I hope you're doing well. You know, I, the last couple days, you heard me complain about things. The next time you, see, you hear me, or see me, if you know me personally, next time you hear me complain, call me on it. I don't want to be that guy. I really don't. I tell a story about a friend of mine who told me when I was in college that, and if you're sick of hearing it, I apologize, but people are going to be seeing me for the first time and never heard it. I was complaining about life. I was in college. I had no problems in the world at the time, relative speaking, you know? And I was com complaining to a buddy of mine named Adam, and he looked at me and said, Johnny, I cried because I had no shoes till I met a man who had no feet. Um, and it's hung with me. It's been like a theme of my life. Um, I complained a few days ago, and I, all I've been meeting are people with no feet, people that have problems that are so legit and so heavy. Don't let me do it again. I'll try. It's not on you. It's on me. But if you catch me, say something. Um, got a beauty. By the way, let me go back. A couple days I've been complaining. It all sorted itself out. So look at this. Do you guys remember the this morning I had a... Uh, Dragon's Breath. It looked like it had its tongue out. This is the Chocolate Reaper uh, version of that. Just a spectacular pepper. This is a Carolina Reaper chocolate version. Look at that. Look at the bumpy nature of that thing. That beautiful little stinger. Gorgeous little pepper. This thing weighs, hang on. Let me zero this thing out. Four grams. This little thing weighs four grams, and boy, could it. Packs a punch for four grams, isn't it? All right, so I'm gonna cut this thing open. I'm gonna snag a photo for my Instagram. Then we're gonna eat this bad boy and tell you what I think of it. This pepper was grown by Jimmy Pickles. So Jimmy, I wanna thank you, my friend. Um, if you guys, now, sometimes you'll see me do uh, videos of peppers where I'm eating them. They're always eating them. I'm always eating them, but sometimes you can get those pods and I'll let you know when that happens. But sometimes I'm eating pods that are from seed sellers. Um, well, you can get the seeds of these pods. You can't get the pod themselves. This is one of those cases. So unfortunately you won't be able to eat this pepper unless you buy the seeds and grow it. Now, Robbie, Robbie Robertson, such a, a legend. He is in the Hall of Fame, uh, the Chase the Heat Hall of Fame. Um, and the camera is so amazing, it's beautiful. By the way, I don't know if you noticed, it really helps smell a vision, it just does. Um, but in spite of that, you're gonna get a better vision of, these, of this if you go to my Instagram. Look at this thing. Super oily. Uh, you can't quite tell, but the, the wall lining of this pepper is very oily, a very large per, uh, placenta relative to the size of, of the pot itself. Very thin walled, just a neat looking pepper, huh? Arr. All right, beautiful pod. Smells super strong. You know what I've done before? I, I bet you I've done it 50 times during a video. I'll smell it and touch my nose. I try not to touch it, and by the time the video is done uh, uploading, my nose is burning. I'm rubbing it. Um, I miss, didn't do it that time, but boy, this is a just a gnarly looking little pepper. You know, floral to me is a taste. It's it's kind of uh, flowery and fragranty. You know what I mean? And I can't really. I don't know. if This smells like it's going to be floral. Fortunately, I've gotten very good with a floral thing. Before I do, actually, yeah, I'm gonna read two really cool comments. But let me eat this first. I'm Johnny Skull. This is the Carolina Chocolate Reaper, grown by Jimmy Pickles. This is Chase the Heat.
earth tones. And you know, I've been trying to figure out a better way to describe earthy other than to say it's dirty. It's dirty, it's earthy. Um, earthy, floral, and the finish was bitter. While I was tasting the floral, I really wasn't catching the bitter. The bitter was the, the finish. So that was kind of weird. So it started off kind of earth tones, dirty, so to speak, moved into floral, and then finished on bitter. Usually, you get the, if I had bitter and floral, they're usually together. That really was very separated, really distinct. Now, while I let the heat build, the burn's already just in my throat, which is what a seven pot Primo and a Reaper will do to you. Now, I'm gonna read you a couple really cool comments from Riders on the Bus. First one is uh, the J, or the Joe Show 601. This is referring, uh, this was in reference to the, uh, the, the 15 videos back, I ate, uh, 18 chocolate primatales. This is what it says. It's fitting the world's, oh, wait a minute. Yeah, it's fitting the world's hottest pepper looks like something that was grown in Satan's garden. Listen, that's a great comment. I thought that was funny. Deserve mention. But this is one I really, really love. I really like this one a lot. And this is from Sharon Chandler. So Sharon, thank you. Listen to this comment. It's by William Penn, okay? No pain, no palm, no thorns, no throne, no gall, no glory, no cross, no crown. She says, love you, you're the man. I'll tell you something. That's, I'll say it one more time because it's that good. No pain, no palm, no thorns, no throne, no gall, no glory, no cross, no crown. Heavy duty. Now, since I'm done reading that, just about perfect. It seems like it's peaked. Solely burning in my throat, almost nowhere else. Non chili head, boy, oh boy, it would be a hot one. Even a teeny sliver of it would be super, super hot for a non chili head, even if you got just a teeny little bit of the pepper. Uh, if you are one of us on the bus who likes to eat hot stuff, this is a nine or 10 all day. Um, I don't think it was hot, as hot as, uh, hard to say, that's pretty hot. Um, I don't think it's as hot as the, it burns different than the primatale, but it's a very, very hot pepper nonetheless. Four gram monster, huh? Anyway, um, we're gonna wrap it up. Thank you uh, for all the good wishes and the prayers, you guys are great. Um, I'm not gonna complain anymore, I don't wanna be that way. I have it so good, life, you know, really. But thank you guys for hanging out with me. You guys are awesome. In the description box, you're gonna see Jimmy Pickles. All right, check them out. If you wanna grow, grow some chocolate uh, Carolina Reapers, get those seeds from him, okay? So you'll see the link in the description box. He also has his YouTube channel. Uh, it'll be posted below. So uh, if you wanna see uh, how these are grown, uh, you can take a look at that video, all right? Um, right here, you're gonna see our pepper, collectively ours. The Royal Hours. Um, if, you, uh, if you've never clicked that, it's mine. I'd like it to be ours. So if you've never clicked that, Pepper, click it. When you do, you ride on the bus with us. We're all one big happy team here. If you don't want to miss a video because spicy content is your gigantic breakfast spread, then click the bell for notification. You'll see a Dropbox, right? Select all, which is the top one. But really visit us a lot. If you really don't want to miss any videos, visit us a lot. Because if you solely rely uh, on YouTube uh, notifications, You'll be disappointed with YouTube, not me. So visit us frequently. Right here is Legal Fire. Some exciting stuff coming up with them, so pay attention. Boom, right there, more videos. Thanks for hanging out with me. I love you guys. I'm Johnny Scoville, and this was Chase the Heat.